Caddis Maximus here. This time with a quick review of the Porter Cable 333 5-inch Random Orbit Quick Sand Finish Sander. Uh, this sander works pretty well. It's pretty reliable. Um, it has a 2.4 amp motor, so it's pretty powerful, but it has two fans in it, or a double-sided fan, one for the uh, dust extraction. It uses the hook and loop, and then these holes, and it comes with a special thing to poke the holes, or you can just, you know, use a screwdriver. Uh, and it sucks the sand through and into this cartridge here that you tap out, and it works okay. It's better to get an adapter and put a vacuum cleaner on it. Uh, as compared to those like the Rockwell or Porter Cable 505 or 330 Sanders, this is definitely not as nice. Definitely doesn't run as smooth. We'll give it a run. So as you can tell, it's much louder and it's a lot of it's this vacuum part that rattles around. Um, so you'll probably want to wear hearing protection, but the nice thing it, about a random orbit sander is it spins around this way, of course, and it, it runs like a normal orbital sander, uh, except for it's not regulated, so it doesn't make patterns, either little circles or little lines when you're sanding, and in some situations that's important. So that's why I'd recommend having a random orbit sander. Um, but uh, if you can find a good deal on these Porter cables, they're pretty reliable, but uh, they're definitely a bit noisy. That would be my biggest complaint. Um, and it doesn't have a shielded power switch, so that will probably get clogged up after a while and you'll have to take it apart and clean it. Uh, you should always blow out your sanders often because obviously they clog up a lot of dust. So uh, that was just a quick review of this Porter Cable Sander. Please subscribe or give a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Cast Maximus out.